which is Someone very just funny. said, whoa, 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 are Jason and Julia dot, dot, <laughs> dot, question mark, question mark, question mark. <laughs> Jason and Julia. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. I can tell you, Jason and I, yes. Uh, I said we're going to try not to scare anyone, it's Julia. It's a horror stream, Jacob. I literally said we're going to try not to scare anyone when we come in. And then you came in with a sudden noise, which <laughs> scares everyone. Rachel Mays is scared. The first thing I said, the only thing I said was that we're not going to scare anyone. Horror. Horror. That's your first lesson. I feel like you need to scoot more this way. No, I, I don't need to do anything. Hello. You know, I say people are being really demanding of Elden and like commanding Elden to do things, but like, what if Elden rang already? What are you talking about? Elden. <laughs> what did any of that mean? Yeah. <laughs> I. It's a bit of a reach, Julia. You lost, My jokes? You lost me entirely. What if Elden rang already? So you're of Elden you, rang so like you're all... your reading <laughs> of the title of the game is someone. Don't worry. He just he just it hit him. It hit him just now. It didn't saying... just hit me. It's not a good joke. Can I finish the <laughs> intro? So we're doing bone game. Kind of. We're doing Elden Ring. I've been playing the game. I've been loving it. But I'm not even that deep into it yet. So I can't do like, you know, ones where we draw the bosses that are in the game because I don't want to spoil myself for all the bosses. Wait, here's another here's another joke. <laughs> uh huh. Oh boy. I don't really like Elden Ring. I prefer silver rings. That's even worse. <laughs> what? That's even worse. <laughs> like hey. you're making less and less sense. Like the game itself. Julia. Well, let's have Nathan draw. Julia, why did you do this to my intro? <laughs> so now we have attained control of Stanley. Mm -hmm. We sure have. And what you'll learn through what Julia is doing here <laughs> is that there are many ways to play this game. Like ignoring it entirely. This is a, a really fun one to start with, I think. Okay. <laughs> I regret letting you play a game. <laughs> Any game. All of his co-workers were gone. I also don't know if I said Tifa83 or Ronaway or Tsun Yakuza or One for the Dagger or Magic Impact. I think I didn't say any of those. Who are you? Soon Yakuza actually just followed, so they got a shout out for no no good reason. Underwater fungi party honked. And it's the year anniversary of honking. A whole year of honks. <laughs> You're actually going at like opposite time you? with the goose. I shouldn't have let you play this game, is what I'm learning. That's what I'm learning right now. Bus Ted! I regret letting you play a game. Stanley went around touching every little thing in the office, but it didn't make a single difference, nor did it advance the story in any way. You tell him, narrator. Narrator, get her, get her ass. progress we're live streaming <laughs> we're live streaming on the internet you can't just rude goose you know this one guy with his keys forever yeah, I can't. Yeah, I can't. a lot of the chat is is yelling let julia honk but i know 
that we gotta make some progress at some point. No, we don't. We simply have to. I support I Julia. Keys. <laughs> if it were just the two of us playing this game, I would let her do this all day long. No, we wouldn't. I would just stop paying attention. But I have to pay <laughs> that attention is true. now. Because we're doing an internet stream. Fight me. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I realize that investing your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. There's someone you've been neglecting, Stanley. Someone... What? Really? I was in the middle of something. Do you have zero consideration for others? Are you that convinced that I want something bad to happen to you? Why, I don't know how to convince you of this, but I really do want to help you, to show you something beautiful. Look, let me prove it. Let me prove that I'm on your side. Give me a chance. <laughs> you play like a squirrel. <laughs> now listen carefully, this is important. Okay, who's subscribing today? You put me on a new controller? Well that yeah. You're not gonna Who remember. Who knows any of, how of Granny Smith's gonna play anyways. this time? You never remember the buttons regardless, so it doesn't matter. I remember the buttons when I'm actively playing. Again. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Big attack. Tiny attack. That's Harry, Harry. Your, your favorite move. Oh, this isn't a satisfying feeling. It's kind of, this button tires me to press on this controller. It tires you to press. I can't press it with as much ferocity you as don't, the last you one. You don't have to push it that fast. There's no reason to push it that fast. That you know of. Being on a new controller is really messing with my groove. You don't have a groove. You haven't played this in weeks. <laughs> There's no groove. The muscle memory that I had is gone. Do you want me to change the controller? No. I could switch it out. No, this is where we are today. We already got the PS5 cord and I can give you a PS5 controller. No, I'm using the Sonic controller. We I, have to live with this. I got a, a new Xbox controller so that I could play Forza Horizon 5 easier. And that's just the one I happen to have plugged in. And it does look like Sonic the Hedgehog, the controller. I didn't know until after I bought it that it looked like Sonic the Hedgehog. It also looks like those Haribo sharks. Oh yeah, you're right. Baby, you're a fireball. Come on, let's go down the hall. That was, that was, this is, this is bad for a gamer. <laughs> I forgot which one's shield. No! What? You weren't even facing them. <laughs> you didn't even face them. I feel... With this controller... Do you want to switch? <laughs> that I am <laughs> relearning. I'm getting the other controller. <laughs> We're not going to listen to this the whole stream. Unplug it. I haven't used an Xbox controller in years. No. Okay, we're back. It's not working. What happened to the sound? The sound in the game is gone. <laughs> Just this was this was the greatest mistake. I'm sorry. I've ever made. I didn't think it would be that big of a deal. I think you have to reboot the game. Okay. I think you have to reboot the game. <laughs> I got, got a leaf. leaf! You got a leaf? I got a leaf? Wow. This is big news. Neat. Neat. And on that note, we're gonna end this stream. And 
and we're gonna leaf the internet. Hey, you know what? We're gonna, on that note, we're gonna leaf two puns. Like music note? Yeah. But I said the same thing. You said the same thing I said. You well, said the same thing I said again. So, we're gonna go. Goodbye, guys. <laughs> Thank you for subbing. We'll see you Sunday. Oh, there's like a big triangle up ahead. I love a big triangle. This would be on like one of those tiny house Instagrams being like, would you spend a summer here? In this beautiful house, in this beautiful place. I love it. I follow one like interior design thing and like every week they have one post that's like, would you stay in this place or this place? <laughs> and it's like two gorgeous places I could never afford. Order of the Void Surveillance Volume 1, Human Sacrifice. Oh no. Oh. oh no. Oh no. Cool. Oh no. Bye, Lisa. The walls oh. are um You know? Doing some some stuff. Would you stay in this Would house? Would you stay for in summer? this house? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who can say <laughs> where the road goes? Where the day flows? Only time. And who can say? <laughs> Damn, it's pretty close, actually. <laughs> it is. <laughs> Made my night on. Julia's wearing her cool Gundam shirt today, and her cool jacket, and she has her cool face and glasses and hair and personality. Uh, my mom called me today because uh, she was very excited. She just called to say this one thing, which is that someone sent an email um, saying that her recipes were beginner friendly and that they had mobility issues, but the way that my mom has you cook things, it's amenable to, you know, people with mobility issues. Uh, and she was so excited. She said she cried about that email. So if you make any of her recipes, please tweet them at her or email her. Yeah. Because it's a huge boost for my mommy and boost your mommy. A lot of stuff's happening in the fam right now. We thought my dad broke his ass this weekend. Dad broke his ass. Dad dad broke his ass. Dad broke his ass. Dad dad broke his ass. Dad broke his ass. Dad dad broke his ass. Dad broke his ass. Dad dad broke his ass. My daddy broke his ass cuz he fell off a ladder. He did fall off a ladder. <laughs> okay, we got this. Just gotta focus up. <clears throat> We're not gonna mess up and be stupid. We're gonna be so smart. Okay, I got this guy. It's a cowboy hat. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Okay, that one's through. Oh, did it too soon. <laughs> as long as the present guy is alive, that's all that matters to me, personally. I'm gonna rotate it the right way this time. I know okay. the way to rotate it. It's this way. Yeah! No! <gasps> it kept rotating! That's not my fault. <laughs> it kept rotating. You know what? That's fair. It, it is what it is. It rotated twice. It is what it is. Oh you my saw. god, now we're different jobs. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him! Restart. You dropped the cowboy hat. <clears throat> it wasn't a cowboy hat that time. It wasn't? It was heart sunglasses. It's random each time? Yeah. So we really just lost the cowboy hat? We lost the cowboy hat. Alright, I'm back at my old job! Okay. Oh! Okay. Ooh. That was too soon. The most dangerous game. Alright, he's safe. I dropped him in a damn hole. <gasps> a tie! Did we drop it in the hole? Did it get dropped in the hole? Did we drop the tie in the hole? I think we dropped the tie in the hole. Jacob? I think we dropped the tie in the hole. We dropped the tie in the hole? I think we dropped the tie in the hole. Listen. 
Now that we've both loved and lost, we can move on. I've lost a tie. I lost a cowboy hat! Yeehaw, <laughs> motherfucker! <laughs> Who's this? Oh, he's cute. Just a damn normie ass bitch. <laughs> Give me a good Melbit with a cowboy hat. I feel like me, <laughs> me and Julia are hitting, like, lately we're really hitting this at the same time where every time I want to say something, Julia <laughs> quietly Sorry. makes a joke simultaneously. And I love Sorry. that for her. I mean, the joke is was really good. That was a good one. I just don't know what's happening. I feel like our timing is, like, is like off lately. Yeah. You know, we're, we're not well, on the same page. Do better, Jacob. We should break up. <laughs> That's a good idea, I think. <laughs> Said while means. yawning. <laughs> <laughs> um, we're playing Sherlock Holmes' big mystery party. Yeah. We played this game a very long time oh, yeah. ago in one of our very earliest streams we did together. That's true. Before we were even dating. That's Ooh. true. When I was visiting you on the Long Island. That's true. Yeah, uh, I came to Long Island to hang out with Julia today. And um, we've been traveling around Long Island. And, yes. And Julia doesn't do so hot with dairy. So, of course, she just had a giant fucking milkshake. And now her brain is busted. <laughs> My brain is hella busted. Uh, Keegan said, whoa, never seen your faces before, lol. Hey. Hi. Hey, buddy. Hello. This is our faces. This th This is us. Cute. Guys, this is so off topic, but I love goats, and this girl I like remembered and sent me videos of goats. Yeah, that's a good sign. That's a good sign. If someone's, you know, thinking about you and trying to send you things that make you happy, that's Hell a good sign. Hell yeah. But I'm also an oblivious idiot, so I never pick <laughs> up on those things. Classic oblivious idiot, Julia Lepetit. Today I'm learning that I'm very bad at, I mean, I'm learning that basically there's a reason I am single. This is where I keep my post. <laughs> I don't tell people I like them, and I'm very bad at picking up clues. So basically someone has to come up to me and go, yo, let's date. Yo, let's go, date. Oh, okay. Sure. <laughs> my archive. Uh, today I, I inquired with Julia if she was interested in anybody, and the answer I got back was, I'll keep that information until I die or something. What did you say? <laughs> yeah, I said, yes, there is someone I'm interested in, but no, I will not tell them. I will die oh, with God. it. I will die with it. I'm as, like, as oh, per no. my huge. That's not the way. I just, I don't know. I, I hope things will pan out with it no effort of my, my... Toby! Brave Toby. The Brave Toby. Anyway. Jacob's back. I'm back. I'm sorry I was oh, yeah. gone again. Oh yeah, Julia's got her new PBS sweater on. I got my my Jacob sweater on, made by my own child hand and foot. We just have true statements about ourselves on our sweat sweaters today. Yeah, I am Jacob. Jacob is Jacob, and I love PBS. <laughs> Jacob is Jacob is the new love is love. <laughs> Jacob is Jacob. Jacob man. is Jacob, and we have to respect it. I was just joking with Julia the other day because we both got new clothes in in the mail. Mm -hmm. This this was Julia's new clothes. I said, Julia, you got new clothes and they look like a Harvard professor. And okay. the, the new clothes I got in were a shirt that says daddy on it yep. and high-waisted pink corduroy pants made by Trixie Mattel. <laughs> yeah. And I was like, we're headed in two different directions with our clothing purchases. <laughs> so one of us is a Harvard professor and one of us is a freaking disaster. There must be balance. There must be balance in the force. Next up, it'll be Are the That's ones true. guilty of... Choose wisely. Also, someone said his Dark Materials is so good. Kate Monstar said his Dark Materials is so good. It's my favorite book series. It's kind of my favorite thing ever. It's my forearm tattoo. I thought I was your favorite thing. You are. You're my favorite person. You're my favorite person. I don't know if I believe it. You're my favorite real person, and I love you. Thank you. You're welcome. Looks like this guy's got the right to bear arms. Hey! Yes! Because the arms kind of look like bear arms. Yeah. Yes. It's, it's rainy today. <laughs> <laughs>
How long long do you think it's going to stay overcast for? Yeah, I I feel like I haven't seen the sun in a while. At least I feel that way. (laughs) Hmm. I don't know why. For some reason, I just, I feel like I don't have any vitamin D in my body. It's like there's (laughs) no serotonin flowing suddenly. I don't know why. So weird. Karina's going to go home later and be like in tears, furious about how good my joke was. (laughs) And be like hitting the table and be like, it was so funny, but I couldn't. Punching the air. But I couldn't act like it was funny. I can't give him that. Jacob, I almost made that joke earlier, but I stopped myself because I was like, "Mm, someone's kind of stupid. It's a little on the nose. It's uh, it's a little overdone. No, it's on the arms. You even said, mmm. (laughs) Mmm. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Julia likes them. Yeah. Thank you for your support. Julia has to like them. <laughs> we should start dating again. <laughs> oh, this is beautiful. Okay, that that I'm okay with. <laughs> there is so much dust on your wall. Yeah, it's a dusty wall. Won't be my problem for long. That's true. Guys, we're moving to a dope-ass apartment. <clears throat> yeah, we are. I'm so excited. No longer will I live in a basement studio that's home to the world's largest supply of spiders. Instead, I will live in a third-floor pre-war walk-up with two bedrooms. Two beddies. One and a half bathrooms. Jacob and I not sleeping in the same bedroom. We're sleeping in separate bedrooms. We're sleeping in separate bedrooms. <laughs> we got windows on the front. We got windows on the back. We got skylights. There's a skylight over the tub. There's a skylight over the tub, y'all. That means the angels can see my wiener when I bathe. (laughs) And that's what it's all about. (laughs) Oh my god. That's what is wrong with you? That's goals. Who are you? <laughs> you can't make me laugh that hard. Most least gifted I can't a breathe. to MJ Bird. I don't even have any water anymore. Oh my god. I'll get you some more water because really I want some me. water. I didn't expect you to think that was so funny. <laughs> that means the angels can see my wiener when I bathe. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm losing my mind. We gotta move in very shortly. And then you're gonna see a whole new apartment behind us. And it's gonna be our apartment. Yeah. Not just Jacob's apartment. No. And then, um... Oh my god. He's got himself a seltzer. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Welcome to the stream. Hello. It's good to see you all here tonight. Yeah, I I do apologize, everyone, that we didn't get an earlier tweet today. It's been like a bit of a crazy day for us. Yeah. Um, specifically, there's been like something weird going on with Julia's hand. Yeah. Like a weird issue. I don't know. It might be... It might be because it's being weighed down by this rock. Let's go! We're engaged! 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 Let's go! Yeah. We got you, gamers. Yeah. You, you were believing it. You thought something was wrong. Because there usually is. You thought something, something was hand. wrong with Julia's hand, but it wasn't wrong. We just got engaged last night. Yeah. Should, do you want to get it in the camera there so people can see? Yeah. Look at the beautiful ring. Ooh, it's very purple right now. It's very purple right now. We are engaged to be married. Today, it's Alexandrite. Yeah, which we we realized today is actually my birthstone. Yeah, weirdly enough, that was just coincidental. Yeah, we just picked it because we thought it was cool. Yeah, um, but it's got extra meaning. Yeah, 
people were asking for the story. Um, I can tell the story very short and sweet before we get into gaming for the night. Uh, basically, the story is I, I wanted to propose in France while we were there, specifically at Mont Saint-Michel, which is the really cool medieval town that's like out in the water. Mm -hmm. And it looks like a Game of Thrones castle, kind of. And it's one of Julia's favorite places. And um, that was where I wanted to do it. But then I got COVID instead the day before we were supposed to go there. Yep. And so it obviously wasn't going to happen. And that was a big bummer. So instead, I set up yesterday a whole like French themed day of like dates. And we had like baguettes delivered in the morning. Oh, and they were then, so good. We went out to like a nice French dinner mm -hmm. and and had cocktails and had a whole day plan that was French themed. And then when we got back, I made Julia wait in the hallway <laughs> in, the, in the hot, humid hallway of our apartment. And then I got some some French music going and mm -hmm. I put on a YouTube video of Mont Saint Michel on the screen. And I was like, this is the second as close as I can get it. I know it's not there. Yeah, but it's as close as I can get it. And so then that that was when I did it. I did the proposal yeah. there in front of the the screen in front of YouTube, like we always are. <laughs> yeah, in, in front of God and YouTube. I liked it. I'm glad you liked it. I was I was worried at first that it would be like too stupid and goofy, but no, I think you did an excellent job. Thank you. I think I thought it was perfect. Thank you. People want to know if I knew, and um. No, not really. I had maybe like, I definitely had like the thought that it was like a thing that could be happening, but not like, I didn't like bet on it <laughs> uh, because I am romantically stupid. Yeah. Julia's got like no romance brain. For myself. Yes. For, yeah. When it comes to herself. When Jacob and I started dating, he like led up to asking me if we were going to you know, he was, you know, he was like basically saying like, you know, it was my confession. Yeah. And then you were like, is that okay? And I was like, the whole time I was like, oh yes, he wants advice about someone else. <laughs> <laughs> and then he said it was about me and I was like stun locked in my house. And I was like, hell, <laughs> what, what do I do? <laughs> me? Yeah. Um, yeah. Julia's uh, doesn't have that part of her brain. She does not detect flirting. Oh, never. Never detect flirting. Never. So it's it all comes as a shock. Mm-hmm. Was this always this thing? This, like, Cornetto-esque thing? I believe so. Okay. That all seems... Oh, my God, when we go to France, I'm going to eat so many Cornettos. Yes. I do realize that the thing that I just said was that when we go to France, I'm going to eat all the Cornettos as if, like... France isn't known for delicious and amazing foods. And I'm like, Cornettos! That's what you go to France for. Yes. <laughs>